For over a month in the summer, the Embassy Theater opens up its doors on Wednesday nights for music and companionship in the community. It also serves as a platform for local artists to showcase their talents in an intimate setting. That's why summer nights at the Embassy are positively Fort Wayne. I love it. I love the atmosphere, everything about it. And that you can have the option to go upstairs on the rooftop and then come back down here, eat and have drinks. Between the music, dancing, and location. I think it's beautiful. It's really, it's got a great vibe. Uh, it's elegant, it's beautiful. It's, I like the intimacy of the place. The vibes at Summer Nights at the Embassy are unmatched. So originally this started off Summer Nights as a great way to showcase um, the site of the building when the building opened and uh, after it was converted from a hotel to an event space. Since then, Summer Nights continues to be a low-cost weekly summer event at only $5 a concert with a Fort Wayne focus. We have all local uh, caterers, all local musicians, and so it's just a, a great time for a low-cost event for the community. It's been popular, so it keeps going popular for a variety of reasons. I'm celebrating my birthday. Including the artist. Ty Causey. Ty Causey. Ty. Anytime I can be involved in the Fort Wayne uh, uh, community and giving back my gift to them, and that's always important to me. And, you know, Embassy, I've performed here on several occasions, and every time I perform here, it's like, you know, I grew up and when this place was a, a movie theater back in the day. And to be able to come here and actually be part of a, um, at the entertainment is just totally awesome. Summer Nights serves as a platform for local artists to not only perform in a historic venue, but as a way for the community to show their support. We have to support local musicians, businesses, whatever. We have to support them to keep it going. And we are blessed in this city with so much of that. And it means just as much to the artists. I just think that most people who, uh, who come out to these events see a whole new side of, of uh, Fort Wayne when they, when they come to uh, like the summer uh, series like this and, and they get a better appreciation for some of the, the artists that's, a, that's in the town. I got a really, really supportive following and I'm so appreciative. I'm totally humbled by the people that come and, and hear me sing and, and give my gift back to them. So if I can bring joy to their hearts, that means I did my job. And there was a lot of joy in that room that night. Of course, that was a couple of weeks ago when Ty Causey performed new artists every week. Um, a lot of fun there at Summer Nights. Yeah, Fantasy. and there's so much great local music. Yeah. And like I said, they started uh, kind of just showcasing the incredible building, mm -hmm. but there's so much talent there. So it's just a great affordable option. Yeah, and one of the uh, folks that we interviewed said, you know, we have live music pretty much six days a week here in Fort Wayne, so we're very blessed to have that in our community. Yeah, such a thriving local music and art scene here in Fort Wayne. And the next performance of Summer Nights of the Embassy is on this Wednesday, of course. Sunset Musica will be taking the stage in the ballroom. Again, tickets are only $5. Doors open at 5.30 and music starts at 6. There will be three more concerts after this upcoming one on Wednesday. And starting at 6, that's early enough that yes. we can actually even swing by there to see that. See this story again. Great job, Sierra. And all of our previous stories, just head to Wayne.com, hit the news tab, and look for Positively Fort Wayne.